hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding how to generate an access token for the github account so currently in the screen you are seeing the github account of our roommates and in the video we will be showing about how to generate an access token for your github account so we all know that a couple of months back github has deprecated the method of authentication using the password so to perform jit operations from now you have to use the access tokens so if you enter github password it will show some error message like it will be not getting succeed so instead of using password you have to use access token so in order to generate access token what you have to do is that you have to log in to your github account first then you can see your icon at the right side click on that and you have to navigate to the settings option so if you go to settings here you can see a section called developer settings so click on developer settings and here you can see an option called personal access tokens so simply click on personal access tokens and you have to generate a new token so cl simply click on generate new token so it will redirect us to this page where we have to enter a name for account so i'll just enter the name as odoo and you can set the expiration for this token whether it has to be remain only for seven days 30 days 90 or anything and if you need no expiration you can set no expiration so i have choose no expiration or you can go with 30 days i'll give like this and you have to specify the scopes like what whole permission should this token has so in order to understand the scopes you can just read this option so you can understand the scope of each variable from this page so i'm not going to explain this so right now what i'll do is that i'll grant all the permission to my token so i'll select all these thing just notification user delete repo write discussion admin enterprise and all the selection i have selected and you have to simply click on generate token so once you click on generate token you can see a token has been generated so once the token has been generated make sure that you will be copying and pasting it somewhere you can see make sure to copy your personal access token now you won't be able to see it again so we cannot get the same code again but we can delete this code so right now you simply co copy this and paste it in some google sheet or somewhere so this is how simple you can generate a personal access token so once you generate the token for performing the jit operations like jit pull jit clone or jit push you can instead of entering your password and email simply in the section of email simply paste this token and keep password empty so the authentication can be done using this token so while pushing or cloning a repository you will be asked for github email so in that place just enter this token then it will be asking for password you can enter this token as password or you can keep the password as empty and click on enter the authentication will be succeeded so this is how you can create a personal access token in github and if you click on personal access token again or if you come back to settings if you come back to settings you will, you will not be able to see this token so if i come to the developer settings personal access token you can see we have a token called odu but we will not be able to get the token only we can see there is a token expires on february 20 that is 30 days and you can see it's never used so this is how you can generate a token and i'll be deleting this token as the token won't be used by anyone else so i'll understand i have deleted that token so this is how you can generate a personal access token in github so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you